How's it going guys, JCVP11 here, and the Samsung Galaxy Note 7 manages to incorporate not only a fingerprint scanner like its last generations, but also a new iris scanner. Both are great biometric ways to keep your phone safe and unlock your phone, but which one is better? To set up, the fingerprint sensor is a pretty standard affair. Touch the home button a few times, adjusting for any missed readings, and in a matter of time, you should be golden. The iris scanner on the other hand requests users to remove any eyewear that they're wearing and essentially scan their iris. In setup, the iris scanner wins by a fair margin. But what about real-world use? In typical unlocking fashion, using the fingerprint scanner, the Note 7 managed a quick and impressive time of just over a second, while the iris scanner managed to unlock the device in just over 3 seconds. The fingerprint scanner is the clear winner here, because you don't have to go through the swiping motion, nor do you have to press the power button for the device to wake up and actually start scanning your iris like you do when using the iris scanner. Not to take away from the new iris scanner, it is very capable, allowing users to unlock their devices with their glasses on. Once the initial setup is complete, it even allows users to unlock their phone in complete darkness or even with just one eye, if you're feeling pirate enough. But even though functional, it takes a lot of getting used to and is very inconsistent at times. The iris scanner is great for showing the world you have the latest technology and I'm sure it'll get better in the future just like the fingerprint sensors did but at the moment I'll stick to my fingerprint sensor. As always thank you for watching leave a like and share this video around if you found it useful. I'll catch you in the next one but until then adios.